Hi guys, this is Mrs. York. And as you can see, this isn't Halloween, but our favorite book is Halloweener by Dave Pilkey. There once was a dog named Oscar, who was half a dog tall and one and a half dogs long. Because of his unusual shape and size, all the other dogs made fun of him. Wiener dog, wiener dog, they called him. And Oscar did not like it one bit. Oscar's mother was no help either. Every morning when the dogs walked off to obedience school, Oscar's mother stood at the front yard waving and calling out, Farewell, my little Vienna sausage. And all the other dogs laughed and laughed at him. Most of the time, Oscar was upset by all this, but not today. Today was Halloween, and Oscar was thinking about other things. All day long at obedience school, Oscar daydreamed about Halloween night, trick-or-treats, and scary costumes. When Oscar got home, he dashed upstairs to start working on his scary Halloween costume, but when he got to his room, a surprise was waiting on him. Happy Halloween, my little sausage link, said Oscar's mother. I've made you a costume to wear for trick or treat. When Oscar saw the costume, he nearly fainted. It was a giant hot dog bun, complete with mustard, and guess who was supposed to fit in the middle? Oscar did not want to hurt his mother's feelings, so he decided to wear the silly costume. That night, all the dogs gathered on the block to show their scary costumes. Everyone was looking quite scary. Then Oscar showed up looking quite frank. When the dogs saw Oscar in his silly costume, they howled and laughed. Look at Oscar, they cried. He really is a wiener dog. Poor Oscar was so embarrassed. Wiener dog, wiener dog, laughed the other dogs as they ran off to go trick-or-treating. Oscar tried to keep up with the dogs, but his silly dog kept slowing him down. His silly costume. All night long, the other dogs hounded every treat they could get their paws on. So by the time Oscar got to each house, there were no treats left. Soon, trick-or-treating was over and the dogs walked home past a spooky graveyard. Suddenly, a horrible hissing sound filled the air. Hiss! The dogs stopped dead in their tracks. Then out of the graveyard rose a ghastly monster. The dogs screamed for their lives. They dropped their treats and jumped into a nearby pond. The monster moved closer and closer. Please don't eat us, cried the dogs. The monster yowled and hissed. Boo hoo hoo, sobbed the dogs. The monster jumped up and down. Somebody save us, shrieked the dogs. Just then, somebody showed up. It was Oscar, because Oscar was so short, he saw something that the other dogs did not. That's no monster, cried Oscar. And with a loud bark, Oscar waddled up to the rescue. Oscar chomped and tugged with all of his might. And rip. And there, standing in the moonlight, were a couple of ornery cats. Help! cried the cats. We're being attacked by a giant frankfurter. And they ran off screaming through the graveyard. The dogs in the pond had seen the whole thing, and now it was their turn to be embarrassed. We've been chased into a pond by a couple of cats, they moaned. But Oscar was a true friend. He leaped into the water and swam out to the dogs. Oscar's silly costume made a wonderful life raft, and the dogs climbed up. All aboard, Oscar called, and he dog paddled them all back to shore. When they got back to the dry land, all the dogs shared their Halloween treats with Oscar. Because Oscar had been so brave, the dogs changed his nickname from Wiener Dog to Hero Sandwich. And from that night on, nobody ever made fun of Oscar again. Happy Halloweeny!